Hello and welcome to the WPI Lunabotics team's proof of life video demonstration for this year's NASA Lunabotics competition. Our robot features a drivetrain with actuated wheel pods to allow us to not only drive straight, but also point turn and turn about instantaneous centers of curvature. Paired with a rocker suspension system to allow our robot to always maintain four points of contact with the ground, our robot is designed to have maximum maneuverability and traction in the regolith. Our robot also features a chain-driven conveyor mechanism with many scoops to allow us to dig up the regolith. This mechanism is plunged into the regolith, powered by a lead screw, to ensure we are able to extract enough regolith to build a berm. Due to a malfunction in our conveyor mechanism, we were not able to complete the digging cycle. However, this clip shows how much sand we were able to collect before our digger stopped working. Our deposit mechanism was also having difficulties due to the fact that it had just recently rained here. But this clip shows the expected behavior of the deposit when testing with dry regolith simulant. And this is what the berm looks like when we deposit the regolith. Now, let's check out the dimensions and mass of this year's robot. All right, hey, this is Giovanni from the WPI Lunabotics team. I'm here with Professor Ken Stafford, and we are about to weigh our robot. So the procedure is gonna be, I'm going to hold the robot and stand on the scale. We'll capture my weight uh, with the robot in hand, and then I'll put the robot back on the cart, and I'll stand there and then we'll subtract my weight from the weight of me plus the robot, and we'll figure out how much the robot weighs. Yes, let's do it. All right, let's do it. All right. I can see 240.6. 240.6 pounds. And then we will subtract your tear weight there. 179.6. Total weight is 61 pounds, 2.205, 27.67 kilos. Okay? Sweet. Good. All right, so we're measuring the length, width, and height of our robot now. Okay, we are uh, 73 centimeters. And so that's, there's a 75, we're good there. Um, let's look at the width. If you move this board out of the way. And the width is going to be from, uh, actually, let's, do, let's use the plates again on these, on these guys right here. There we go. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay, and we are showing 64. 64.1 centimeters what? wide and vertical. Uh, we are 116 and a half centimeters. So we're good there. Okay. 